to Tender TV, your favorite entertainment gist show. My name is Oluwa Damilola, and with me here in the studio is my favorite, talented, intelligent, amazing, and beautiful co-host, Dynamics. Dynamics, say hi to the viewers. Thank you, Damilola, for the introduction. You're welcome. Um, hi, everyone. And... I bring a list of gists from your favorite Amiibo plug to spice up your day. And topping the list of our gists is the Eddie's Award winning show. And to um, come in conclusion with the gists will be the Gen Z's generational gists that I'm going to be using to spice up what we are about to bring to your table today. So talking about the Eddie's, I'm going to leave it to Dami to um, tell us a brief summary about the Eddie's. Yeah, the 15th Eddie's Award 2022 that happened on Sunday, 5 September 2022 happened live in USA, Atlanta, Georgia. Okay. And people from different walks of life were there. Some artists won awards on Sunday. And um, can you guess one of the artists who won an award on Sunday? Just tell me one of If them. I guess, you're going to pay me. Don't worry, I'll buy a mala for you. <laughs> okay. So, um, Bonaboy. Yes, Bonaboy. won mm. two awards. Opa, oh, I'll be coming <laughs> up passing. Do you remember that song? Happiness, so. Yeah. Okay. So, Whiskey won five awards. One, two, three, four, five. Five awards. Thames won two awards. Davido won two awards. Panther Rankin also won two awards. Uh -huh. Also, Benson, formerly known as Buchu, won the next rated artist of the year. Wow. Yeah. And he went Super home amazing. with Bentley 2022 model. Super amazing. And I'll be the first person to ride in the car with. Yes, <laughs> that's for sure. And also, Ashake. And Fireboy. They all won awards each. Ashake and Fireboy under the um, Olamide's record label. Yeah, yeah, they did. They won two awards also. Wow. So it's all thanks to Olamide for signing them to YBNL. Thumbs up for Olamide. He's such you an amazing man. Yeah, he is. He is. He is. <laughs> so back to my co-host. Let us give us what she asked for us about Gen Z. Because I'm a Gen Z. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. You. Talking about the Gen Z's generation, it is a generation of young folks like us. Like <laughs> young folks, energetic young folks um, that is within the scope of an age bracket. Um, Gen, Gen Z is not about a personality trait, but it is about an age bracket kind of a thing. So the Gen Z focuses on energetic young folks that believes in the way of life. And because of the modern day of expression, the Gen Z's, they tend to do things in a way that is talented and so amazing because most Gen Z's are actually very, very talented. And this modern age of technology has made Gen Z's um, very perceptive of things and they are able to um, take use of opportunities and use it they are able to do things and um, there is a range of there is a range on social media between the millennials and the Gen Z's the millennials are actually um, folks born in the 1980s while the Gen Z's start from the 1997 to the 2012 while the millennials, 1980s to the 1995 or 1996 or so. So the millennials were like, um, the Gen Z's are actually very, very spoiled. So they actually um, related based on their personality traits that Gen Z's are naturally spoiled, but that they do things based on, um, they do things because they're actually on that age or, well, um, the, millenn the millennials actually consider the Gen Z's is very spoiled brat. Well, not all Gen Z's are spoiled because I'm not a spoiled brat, but I'm a Gen Z, probably a Gen Z. You never can tell. But me, what I feel about the 
Gen Z. I feel like the Gen Zs are actually um, they're actually young folks that spice up things. Yeah. Uh, what do you think? Yeah, because I can actually go anywhere, like a party, and wear clothes to the party. I don't care. So as I see that is, everything is settled. The millennials, yes. the millennials actually, we cannot um, override their part also. But I actually feel like um, the Gen Zs, they like to do things differently with a different approach. Yeah. You cannot, okay, come to think of it, um, if I want to set up a kitchen now, the way I would spice up my kitchen would be different yeah. from the way a millennial would actually spice up yeah. his own kitchen. That's it. Because I would want to add the spice that a Gen Z Z would prefer and even a, a millennial would be interested to patronize me. Yeah, that's it. So, so, me, what I feel about the Gen Z, I feel like the Gen Z have a um, higher advantage compared to the millennials. Not to override the millennials though, the millennials are more experienced, but then the Gen Z's tend to use the opportunities of things um, um, around them, like the technology yes, they get. So, so we are actually intelligent for those of you who are watching not because you are Gen Z means you are spoiled not all Gen Z's are spoiled okay. so let us know what we are doing we are intelligent too we know what we are doing and we are proud of ourselves aren't we <laughs> yes definitely I'm so I'm proud proud you, if you are to if you are to give any advice to the gen z's and the millennials what would you say okay to the millennials i would actually say they should take things easy Yes, I know they've been here before okay. we came. So uh, everything, things change. Growth is constant and change is also constant. So they should take it easy on us, the Gen Z's. And the Gen Z should also bow. Not because you are a Gen Z, then you should do things because they say you are Gen Z and you are spelt. Do not take advantage because you don't take advantage of your position okay. today. So let us always bow to our elders. Okay, I think um, for what you're trying to say now, as a Gen Z, you should just stay true to your nature yeah. and don't take advantage of the fact that um, you are a Gen Z and you should start misbehaving yes. and you should always know what you, you are got doing. It. Jeez, my <laughs> sister. That's okay, it. so we have come to the end of this amazing amazing show and we remain your favorite amable plug yeah. stay beautiful and please do not forget to subscribe to our channel to welcome your way next time my name is Oluwa Damilola and I have my beautiful co-host here with me in the building her name is Dynamic yeah we remain your favorite Gen Z so we love you to so welcome your way next time bye bye